Now to export my query here, my sales and profit query to a text file. I'm going to go ahead and close out of it. Right click it, go down to export, over and down to text file. Of course change where it's going to dump it into from my documents folder. Browse to my desktop, double click the exercise folder, and I want to dump it in here. I already exported it once, we'll call it sales and profit. Of course it's already here but as a CSV file, but this is going to be text, so I'm OK, click save. And because it's a text file, I don't care about exporting data with formatting and layout. Click OK. Runs the export text wizard. By default, I have delimited chosen, such as commas or tabs that separate each field one from another. Like the part number, comma separates it from the customer's name, comma, and the actual title of the book. Let's click next. So the default's comma, which is good because I don't want to be able to use any other delimiter. As you can see down below, again, commas. Click next and it's going to dump it right into my exercise folder. Click finish, close out, go to my exercise folder, maximize it here, and there it is. My query sales and profit .txt, double click to open it up, and it exported in a comma delimiter fashion where it has commas separating my fields from one another here. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel, get notified of the latest videos, and for only $2 a month, you can have access to all my Microsoft Office training videos.